Center for Freaks and Geeks at Undeclared, and obviously you were much, it was, a, it was a while ago for you. Yes. You looked a little bit different. Yes. You, you would have to like tilt the camera down if you were talking to me from I then. I might have to be a little bit crouching, yes. Yeah. Do you get recognized a lot for that role? Still? I still do. It's crazy. Because I, I guess my face hasn't changed. Yeah. Um, but, uh, you know, it's one of those shows that, that people will continue to watch because it was so good. Yeah. And it'll, I think it'll, it, it already has sort of gone down in television history. And oh, absolutely. Whether or not I was involved with it, I would be a huge fan, as I am. Yeah, I mean, obviously the show is constantly on the series that shouldn't have been cancelled, that, you know, classic one season things. Did you guys have a feeling that it was really something special that people weren't getting when you were filming the show? I think it was just the understatedness of the show, I think, that people didn't get, especially in the network world. I think the viewers got it. And, and if it had been advertised more, and sort of if they gave it a longer chance to grow, I think that it would have caught on with a lot more people. I find that, that uh, tele uh, network television tends to feel that they need to talk down to their audience a lot of the time. And uh, they, don't, they don't trust that the audience can, can get the subtle sort of nuances and, and long stretches of dramatic moments within what is described as generally a, a comedy, you know, or a dramedy. So I think that uh, I think that just people weren't used to it. And now it's a testament to the show that that you see shows on the air like The Office that, that sort of go for the more subtle understated that have been on the air for so long. And I think that I think that the network really learned from some of its mistakes. Obviously not all of them. Yeah. Yeah. But some. Do you have any favorite moments that stand out to you from the series like, that you're like, I can't believe that happened or what a great moment that was to experience? Um, I, you know, every every day of, of the show that I, that I would go on set was an amazing experience for me. It was, it was like a, a dream, you know, it was everything that I had sort of wanted to do when I was young and putting on plays in my basement and, and, and trying to get kids to act in stupid plays about Vesuvius. <laughs> That's right. I had a play about a volcano. Um, but uh, no, it, it was it was just great to come out here and see that there are so many people that love to do the same thing that I do. And, and uh, and to have the chance to do it on like one of the best shows ever doesn't hurt.